Hey guys, Chris Ruff here. Welcome today to a new video. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys how to reduce the size of your um, FRAP files recordings uh, without losing much of the quality. So I recently recorded a game on uh, using FRAPS, FRAPS, I don't know how you pronounce it, FRAPE, no it's not FRAPE, it's FRAPS or something. Um, and it's a 7 minute video, but it's like 12 gig, it's like 12 gig, like that's huge for like a 7 minute uh, file. So obviously if you can upload it or send it to your friends, so I don't know, what do you do with your record game footage, I guess, upload it. Um, then you want to reduce the file size, right? What you can do is actually use this program called Handbrake, which I have over here. So the links will be in the description to download this program, but essentially it's just a video converter, which is really handy because it really squeezes down the file size um, without actually losing much of the quality. So what you have to do is just download Handbrake, uh, drag and drop your file into the, the interface as such, and it will scan. Um, one thing that Handbrake likes to do though is that it will like crop your video if it finds that um, there's some blank spots or some black bars. So if it's cropped, as you can see, in this case it's not zero zero. But if it was cropped, then just change everything back down to zero. Um, if you don't want your video to be cropped. So actually, honestly, all the settings are really fine. You can leave all the same. Just make sure it's H.264 uh, and that the container is MP4. So you can take Web Optimize to help to lower the file even more. Um, and yeah, that's basically it. Then click Destination, Browse. Uh, I'm going to choose just here, just like BF or something, and then just hit start. So prepare to encode, and then it'll just start um, to, you know, convert the file and make it smaller. So be right back once this is done. Alright guys, so it finished in about, I think like, 5 to 6 minutes. So now we're actually um, I'm done over here, and I'm going to go over to drive B, where I had it on. And as you can see, let's just yeah, as you can see here, it is cut down to six hundred and fifty four MB, which is really quite amazing. From like twelve gig, right? It's six hundred and fifty four MB, which is really useful um if you're uploading videos and stuff. So what I mean by the quality is not really changed is if you call So if you compare the quality of this to that, it really isn't that changed. Okay, let's take let's take a look at this, right? And then uh, we go over to here and we open this up. We go to the same portion uh, over here. You can see that the quality of the video remains largely the same. In fact, if you upload it online, I mean, the quality you don't have to have like excellent quality. I mean, you have to have good quality, but you don't have to have, have it like like super duper HD. So, honestly, it really doesn't remove that much quality. And I think the amount of time you waste trying to upload a twelve gig file. Uh, I mean, sorry, the amount of time you save. I'm looking at uploading a 600 MB file as compared to a 12 gig file is definitely worth um, the little amount of like quality you lose. So this is a really useful program. Um, links once again to the description below. I hope this video helped you guys. So thanks for watching and have a nice day.